The development of new corn hybrids and soybean varieties has to start somewhere. And WCIA 3's ag reporter Stu Ellis has more about a farm near Moequa in this morning's Harvest Heritage Report. Daryl Hall is like any farmer, fascinated with new technology, and says it's in his blood. So we're that third generation, and my daughter will be the fourth generation. The biggest thing I learned from my dad is to be really particular and do the best job you could and always be open to new, innovative things. Well, an example that I still use today is doing or having people doing research on the farm. I try new things. I am one, I won't go out and try something really far-fetched, but if there's something that I read about or hear about that I think might work, I'm willing to try it. And that is what sets Daryl apart from other farmers, says Craig Grafton, production supervisor for Bayer at Stonington. And that's what we like to see with some of our research, too, is, you know, guys that are pushing the envelope on some things, and they're, 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 they're up to speed with, with what's going on in the ag world. And that's some of what we like to see with some of our research, too, is we're putting our hybrids and varieties on ground that we know is, is a good representation of what's going on in the, in the broader region. We've probably been doing this approximately 20 years, and we've had a great relationship. I love getting the, out in the research fields and see what's coming down the pipeline anywhere from a few years to several years away, and that's what keeps farming so interesting. We instilled in my daughter the same philosophy that I got instilled in maybe from my mother and father that the only way you prosper in, in the future is you got to always be looking for that new things that make things get better. And my daughter has grasped that greatly and is even carrying it farther than I was able to because she's more intelligent than I was. <laughs> That's our Harvest Heritage Report. I'm Stu Ellis with WCIA 3, your local news leader.